Hey guys, this is Tom from Tom Tutorials here today, and I'm gonna basically going to be showing you how to upload a file to the Gary's Mod Workshop. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is click the download link in the description, and you're going it's going to come with these three files, the addon.json, the gmad.bat, and the gmpublish.bat. And now what you're going to want to do is simply create a logo of what you want your workshop file to look like so here we go I'll just show you guys a demo so it's basically what's gonna show up right here in this spot like when somebody looks it up so it has to be 512 by 512 as you guys can see right here dimensions 512 by 512 and then here's mine I just just mashed up a real quick one um, darkerpuploaded.net and now you're going to go to the add-on, I just, the folder, I just named it tutorial, and um, you're going to, it has like the models, the materials, the Lua, whatever you want in there, make sure guys that this does not have any capital letters in here, because that will mess it up, so make sure that your Steam is running while you do this, and after that, you're just going to go over here, and you're just going to copy that. And then you're just going to go to GMAD, edit, and then you're going to go add on folder path here, you're going to paste that, and then you're going to go to the output, which says output GMA path here, you're going to click paste, and you're just going to do a backslash, uh, whatever the add on's called, and I just called it tutorial.gma, make sure it's .gma, okay? And now you're going to want to go to, actually just, okay. You know, just close, save that, and go to gmpublish.bat, and you're going to go to GMA path here. Delete that. You're just going to paste what you already have in your clipboard, uh, the tutorials uh, where the add-on is located. And you're just going to go to slash whatever you called it. So I called it tutorial.gma, and now you're just going to go to the icon logo path here. So mine is located. Uh, right here, let's just type this out real quick. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to show you guys an easy way of finding out how you're just going to go to properties and it shows right here at location. You're just going to copy that and you just paste that into there. And then you're just going to click rename. You're just going to select this. You're going to copy the name and paste it after a backslash. Okay into this so now as you guys can see like in the one before it said um the path here for that so what you guys are going to want to do now is open up windows explorer you're going to navigate to your steam steam apps common folder slash gary's mod so you're going to go into your computer uh, program files whichever one it might be uh, steam steam apps common gary's mod now you're gonna go to BIM, and now you're just gonna copy what you have in here, and you're just going to close that. Now you're gonna edit GMAD, and you know where it says GMAD path here, you're just going to paste that in there. Let's just save that, and then GM publish, GM publish path here. You're just gonna paste that and save that. And in case you guys don't know, I'm saving so fast. I'm just type like clicking Control S. So now the final step to this, well not the final one, but it's close. So you see so you this, we haven't done anything with this add-on.json file yet. So you're just going to edit that with whatever you have, notepad, plus plus, sublim text, um, notepad, and you just rename that to whatever you want. Uh, I called it tutorial. And then you're just going to drop that into the folder with like the add-on folder. So now it basically says mo models, materials, Lua, whatever you have in there, and then uh, add on .json. So now you're just going to double click GMAD. Now it might take a little bit longer for you guys if you have a slower computer and it depends on the amount of stuff that you have inside of the folder. And it says successfully saved. Now you're just going to double click GM publish and it's just going to say publishing. This may take a long time and there you go. Now you're just going to click whatever key you want to continue and this is a critical thing this is actually labeled as private on your profile. So you're going to want to go to library, Gary's mod, browse the workshop. Uh, you're going to go to items 
and then you're gonna go actually just go to subscribe files and then just click show by your username and as you can see I have this on there and as you guys can see it is private so you're just gonna go over here change visibility public now that disappears you can edit the title description add edit images and videos add remove contributors post in a private developer section add links even subscribe to it add to collection read it up whatever you guys want to do so that's pretty much how you upload an add-on to the steam workshop so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to hit that subscribe button that's on my channel youtube.com slash tom tutorials i would really appreciate it guys so thanks for watching guys peace out and make sure to check out all my videos yeah.